Utah Rockets with a chance to win the ball game in overtime. Porter driving and got fouled. Got knocked down with 2.4 to go. Excellent play drawn up there from Coach Steven Silas. When he ran into that switch, you create some indecision. Kevin Porter Jr. gets an angle and goes in there and gets absolutely hammered from Joel and B. But that little angle is all that Kevin Porter Jr. needed. And that's why Stephen Silas had Shingun take the basketball out because Embiid had to beeline from the other side of the rim and ends up out of position and had to foul. And now the Sixers are going to challenge the call. As of right now, Joel Embiid is fouled out of the game. So the Sixers are using a timeout to challenge the call with 2.4 remaining in overtime. And, and, and big picture here, Craig. Let's step away. Step away from, from, from a second for the ball. This development and exposure for these guys getting put into overtime situations. Emotions are high are, are, are huge and not sure what is being challenged. I guess I assume trying to keep Joel and beat in the basketball game and maybe saying that the foul was on Melton. Yeah, that's what they're that's what the challenge is about that. It's not an Embiid not to mention it also serves as a chance to ice down Kevin Porter Jr. Yes. Before he goes to the free throw line. And you're going to say Melton probably fouled him on the drive prior to Embiid getting there. So you got two seconds left here on the clock. Uh, Kevin Porter Jr. can put the Rockets up one and he got 2.4 and essentially. Let's see. No, that's clean defense there. Yeah, that that that's what you know Doc is going to challenge is that Melton fouls him on the drive, but and here's the decision by Tony Brothers. Unsuccessful challenge, foul on him B. Two shots. Nope. Unsuccessful challenge. Now it was still